We begin with breaking news tonight. A man in critical condition after a shooting in Pittsburgh's West Oakland neighborhood. Good evening. I'm Ken Rice. Detectives were out at that scene at Fifth Avenue and Seneca Street for several hours. Jennifer Barrasso joins us live with the latest details tonight. Jen. That's right. It was a rather large crime scene. No suspects, no arrests. Pittsburgh police telling me that a man and a woman were inside a vehicle when shots were fired. That man, as you mentioned, in critical but stable condition. Now, take a look at this. There was a little bit of excitement outside of Pittsburgh Police Headquarters. It turned out to be somebody that police questioned in tonight's shooting and had cleared him. That man bolted from officers. They caught him in front of police headquarters. Now, the shooting earlier tonight took place around 6 p.m. on Fifth Avenue and Seneca Street. Zone 4 police officers rushed to the scene. The crime scene rather large. We counted at least 38 evidence markers. A police spokesperson telling me a man and woman in that vehicle were driving when shots were fired. They couldn't say where those shots were coming, if someone shot from a car or on while they were running. Initially, Pittsburgh Public Safety thought there were two people shot, but it turns out there is one shooting victim, that man. He was rushed to the hospital, and at last check, he is in critical but stable condition. After the shooting, the woman driving crashed the vehicle, hitting a pole. She hurt her head and is being treated in the hospital. So once again, Ken, no word on any arrests or suspects when I last talked with Pittsburgh police or any motive in this. And Kara Cruz telling me that at this point in the city of Pittsburgh, there have been 54 non-fatal shootings in the city. Reporting live, Jennifer Barrasso, KDK News.